Okay, we're inside a leader expedition caravan. This thing is an absolute beast. I tell you, not many caravans have this much presence as you're walking up to them, but check this thing out. It's got independent suspension by Cruise Master XT. It's got an ATM of 3.5 ton, so you need a bit of donk to pull that, but this thing is just an absolute beast. Having a look around, it's got two 100 amp hour lithium batteries and 630 watts of solar on the roof. This is a bunky caravan. As you enter, you've got an east-west bed, and then you've got an L-shaped lounge opposite your kitchen with a full-size refrigerator going through to a double bunk and a separate toilet and shower. This thing is a beast. All right, on to the next. Okay, moving on, we've got a Snowy River SRC 21S. This is a semi-off-road van built like a house. We've got an extender or a slide out for the club lounge so you get so much extra room when you're parked up. It's absolutely fantastic. Having a look at the outside, you've got aluminium frame, composite body, seamless lines again, good for strength, good for cleaning. You know, I absolutely love that. Moving in, you've got a queen bed at one end. You've got the slide out club lounge, which adds so much room. That's across from your kitchen. And in the back, we've got the full size fridge and of course the ensuite with a separate toilet shower. All right, moving on. Okay, we're in a Kakadu Kindred Spirit 3. This is a bunky van with a difference. This has independent suspension underneath with shock absorbers. It's got a 3.3 ton ATM and it's 21.6 foot long. Coming inside, you've got the large bed at one end, then a large L-shaped lounge across from your kitchen, full size refrigerator, triple bunky. But the really unique thing about this is they put a Constantina door on the bathroom. So when you're not using it, you have that extra room around the bunkies to get changed and to move around. All right, on to the next one. Let's go. Okay, I'm in the Piazza by Royal Flair, and this has to be the most unique caravan on the market. It's got the seamless composite side all the way from front to back, but what makes this unique is its unbelievable deck. Check this out. This is a deck that goes on the A-frame and look how quick it comes out. The front nose cone opens up as a roof and the floor lifts down from inside. From there, you've got balustrades that just clip in place and it's worth mentioning all of this is sprung or hydraulic driven, so it's light as. And check it out, you've got a whole nother room there. You can go outside without having to worry about snakes or crocodiles. Awesome. But that's not the only unique feature of this. Coming inside, you've got the large kitchen on the left and right, full size fridge freezer, club lounge at the back, which I love, but then where's the bed? It's actually above the club lounge. Check out how fast and quiet this is. Push of one button. Now this does come down lower, but I just wanted to show you how quiet and easy that was to use. It is bloody quiet. It's, it's, actually, quiet. it's actually impressive. Okay, so moving on, at the other end, you've got the ensuite, shower on the left, toilet on the right, and moving through that, of course, you've got access to the deck. This is an amazing use of space in a small format caravan. All right, let's keep going. Okay, come in and check out this Alien X by Aura Caravans. This is a single piece composite all the way from front to back again. No seams, no joins. This is what I like to see. Heading inside, you've got the bed on the left, You've got the kitchen in front of you, including your full-size fridge freezer, L-shaped lounge across, and then you head down the back to the two bunkies. On the opposite side from the bunkies, you've got the full-size ensuite with a separate toilet shower. This is a really beautiful van. It's composite, single piece, and made in Australia. There you go. All right, on to the next one. Okay, we're in a Viscount Wild Shark. This is a gorgeous van. As you come in, you're greeted by a huge kitchen, full-size fridge freezer, and pantry. You've got the club lounge here, the bed all the way at the front, and of course the full size ensuite at the back with the separate toilet and shower. Absolutely beautiful caravan, well worth a look. All right, let's keep going. Okay, I'm in a next gen SE216, and this is my favorite layout. You've got the full club lounge in the back of the van, large kitchen on both sides of the caravan, full size fridge freezer. Then you go through the ensuite with the shower on one side, toilet on the other, through to your bedroom. I've said it before, I'll say it again, this is my favorite layout. If it wasn't for the fact that I need a bunkie for the kids, this is what I'd be in. All right, let's keep going. Okay, we're looking at a Nova Terra Sports 16.6. Now I've got to tell you, I'm quite excited to bring you this one. This caravan has a full composite body, no aluminum frame, just like a turtle, the shell is the structure. That is absolutely awesome. It creates the seamless lines that you know I love and it's super easy to clean. 
This caravan is 16.6 .6 foot, but packing an absolute punch. With airbags underneath, you can fully adjust the ride height. All of the controls are just in this external door here. As you come in, you've got the L-shaped lounge on your left, the kitchen across from that, and then the bed at the end. With a full-size ensuite at the other end, separate toilet and shower, and of course, washing machine. This thing is really worth a look. All right, on to the next one. Okay, I'm in the Crusader Excalibur Prince. This thing is all new. The sides are now full composite, no aluminium frames. The shell is the structure. This absolutely excites me. I love when caravans go this direction, which more and more are. There's no reason to be sticking with the old timber frame. On top of that, this is my favorite layout as well. We've got the club lounge at the back and look at the size of this thing. It's crazy. Heading in, you've got the kitchen on both sides, large TV, pantry drawers, full-size fridge freezer, passing through your ensuite with your toilet on your right, shower on your left, and of course, your full-size bedroom at the end. This is a gorgeous van and the details are absolutely spot on. You should definitely check this one out. All right, let's keep moving. Okay, having a look at the experience by Trail Caravans. This thing is a beast. Have a look at the ride height on this. Coming in, you've got a booth lounge, a large kitchen, full-size refrigerator, large bedroom at one end with a full-size ensuite in the rear, with, of course, a separate toilet and shower. All right, let's keep going. Okay, I'm in a brand new van here, Millard Breakaway. And guess what? Aluminium frame, composite exterior. I love to see that this is the way all the vans are going. There's no need to be building out of hardwood anymore. Okay, coming in on the left, you've got the large bedroom. Then this club-style lounge. Across from that, a large kitchen, full-size fridge freezer, and of course in the back, a full-size ensuite with a separate toilet, shower, and washing machine. Okay guys, well thanks for coming through this top 10 with us. We'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.